Hey guys, I'm very excited with the LGB30 versus the LGB40. So let's get to it. Now, both these phones are extremely underrated and definitely amongst my favorites. So they're extremely fast, they have excellent cameras, great speakers, and they also have headphone jacks. Now in terms of boot up advantage for the V40. All right guys, now for the specs. The V40 has a larger display. Now on the front, the V30 has one camera and the V40 has two. And on the back, the V30 has two cameras and the V40 has three. Both phones support micro SD. And both phones have the same battery. The V40 is an updated chipset and RAM. Both phones are water resistant. Now at the bottom, both phones have type C and believe it or not, headphone jacks as well. And on the back, both are glass. All right guys, so let's just jump into it. All right guys, getting to it. NBC. D40. Netflix. Pretty close. Spotify. B30. YouTube. Again, pretty close there. eBay. That one is actually B30. iFunny. B40. Amazon. B40. Photos, V40, so for basic apps, a narrow advantage for V40, but not a big difference. So now for gaming, should be a bigger, a uh, bigger advantage for the V40. So a strong start here with Temple Run 2. PUBG. So you guys saw a bit of lag there for the V30. And in terms of speed, the biggest difference should be the multitasking. Okay, so a few more games to go. Mario. V40 Asphalt And again you guys saw uh, some lag there for the V30 And now for the big one we got Fortnite Alright so I'm gonna fast forward to it And the V40's up. All right, guys. So next up, we got Geekbench. And gonna run this way in the video. Time now for Chrome. And let's just go to web history. IGN.com B40 INDB.com Again B40 
LG.com. D40. And final website. Nintendo.com. Once again, the B40. No copyright music, hi. And now for the speakers. So first up we have the V30. Back to the voting. So clearly the V40 is a lot better. Now we have the fingerprints. So a narrow advantage for the B40. So now for multitasking. Now remember the V40 is more RAM and very apparent right there. Big advantage for the V40. But Netflix X1 for both. Spotify V40. Now for the basic apps it's not as uh, not a huge deal for them, but for stuff like the gaming, let's try out Temple Run. So yeah, that is definitely an issue for the B30. Super Mario. Fortnite. Yeah, so you guys see, I mean, you're waiting like a minute for this to load up for the V30. Asphalt. Once again, a big advantage there for the V40. And now for Geekbench. And it's going to run it. And a nice improvement there for the V40. Now for camera speed. Advantage for the V40. And now for the selfie cameras. And the stabilization. And now for the selfie cameras. And the stabilization. And look at the wide angle cameras. And the stabilization. And 
the book the maximum zone. All right, guys, so it said at the beginning, both these phones extremely, extremely underrated. Now, I would say it's a nice upgrade from the V30 to the V40, but definitely not necessary. So, yeah, guys, as always, thanks for watching. Subscribe for more. And I'll see you next video.